I've got one of the most popular training aids with me here, the impact bag. Everybody says that impact is the moment of truth. Well, how do we use this impact bag? So I wrote an article about this once. We've discovered with sensors on the people's bodies that there's a sequencing very similar to the throwing motion in baseball or quarterbacks in the NFL. When we put them in the body suits and we measured how they threw the ball, and then we measured the downswing of the best golfers, the hips, the thorax, the arms, the club. Instead of a club, it's a football. They all fire in the same sequence. So one of the things that I see when people use the impact bag is that when they go to swing it, they get very open and out of the shot when they hit the bag. Because their brain's just thinking, I'll just whack this thing as hard as I can. And it gets way too much lift and open with the chest. So what I've done with my students to teach them to properly use the impact bag is I've had them start small and feel like they're throwing it sidearm, similar to Hogan's book. If you remember in Hogan's Five Fundamentals, he had a picture of a guy skipping a rock. So start with your trail arm. And just take it back a little and just feel like you're throwing that sidearm toss. Then take your lead arm and do the same thing. And what you're trying to replicate here is more of a throwing motion, similar to throwing sports. Then what you're going to do is take it a little further and use both arms and then eventually put two hands on it. And that's giving you the feeling of the same sequencing if I was going to throw the ball. Now, all of a sudden, I'm starting to get some power, but I'm doing it with proper sequencing. After I get done with that, then try to hit a ball. Let that sequencing come out that it felt like you were throwing that ball sidearm like Hogan intended in that great book. And if you notice, my sequencing and how I stayed in the shot are just like what you want to see. So use the impact bag for proper sequencing.